he was winning. He went through Hunter, he just took second in the 1500 meter. Talk about how the race went, man. Um, it was really slow, uh, which was expected. We were, I honestly have no idea what the splits were, but it was a jog fest out there. Everyone was tripping over each other and it was kind of messy. And then with like 600, Grant took off. And so a pack of like four or five of us just went. And it was actually still like, there was a lot of bumping around and I was getting hit and stuff. And Blake almost like, um, like tripped up. I, I, we like caught legs with, I don't know, like 200 to go. Um, but yeah, it was just um, really hairy in there. And then with 100 meters to go, there was like a small gap between Logan and Blake. And I like went and I, Blake obviously had an extra gear I didn't have, but I still closed strong. So I was really pleased with it. Definitely. I mean, you guys were all the top three or four. You were divided by like tons of seconds. I mean, just the caliber of the race. I mean, what was your mindset and what was your game plan coming into it? Um, my game plan actually was to go at 600, but my dad, right before I went, he was like, if someone else takes it, just go for the ride. So I went along the outside with about 500 to go, and I was about to just start hammering um, the last 400, because that's where I've went the last couple of races. It's always been 400 meters out. I started to really go, so I was going to do that again today. And yeah, we just started um, we just started going um, really fast. And I, I, like I said, I had no idea what the splits were or anything, but um, we were um, flying down the back stretch and um, I didn't really need to make a move at 600, so that's kind of just after 200, it was just kind of every man for yourself, just finish as strong as you can and see where you end up. Would you say that was kind of a learning experience like no other to have a tactical race like that? so slow. Yeah, I mean, that's, if you watch a lot of the pro races and college races, all the championships are, for the most part, really tactical, and then it's a hard last 400, 600, whatever, so it's great. That's pretty much why we, I was already out in Seattle last weekend, so my parents wanted me to hop in a race that we probably that we thought was going to be tactical and especially with the weather and everything that that was the outcome so yeah it was what well, well, it's what i expected <laughs> Yeah, definitely. I think um, the last two weeks have really been just great confidence boosters. And coming into every race, I, you know, I've kind of had different game plans now. Kind of, you know, expecting to be in the front, expecting to uh, make a move at some point. So yeah, I think it's it's great. Especially it's it's great to enter a race like this where you know I got second, so I'm I'm really hungry for coming in the cross and. Um, my senior year, but yeah, I was definitely, um, I was I was really pleased with how it turned out, I can't complain, Blake's an amazing runner, and, but yeah, the last couple of races I have, you know, gone into the race really confident and just ready to roll.